In today's video, we are going to talk about the upcoming DJI Mini 5 Pro. I will try to explain what kind of specs there can be in the upcoming DJI Mini 5, the price and also release date. I would like to really hear what kind of specs do you want from the upcoming DJI Mini 5, please drop a comment down below. Disclaimer, these are not the final specs of the DJI Mini 5 Pro, but if you stick till the end, you will have a clearer image what kind of specs you can expect from the upcoming DJI Mini 5. So if you're interested about these, let's dive into it. As we all know, DJI is trying to keep this DJI mini series under 250 grams. There's a catch with that, of course, because if you're trying to keep it under 250 grams, it's a little bit hard to put a lot of technology inside in that camera. But DJI has been putting really nice specs in DJI mini series. And they just keep developing and upgrading these drone series so we can expect to see better results with the DJI Mini 5 of course so you know 250 grams but about the flight time DJI Mini 4 is capable to fly to 4 minutes but of course if it's going to be under 250 grams I think maximum flight time is going to be 40 minutes DJI Mini 4 had max distance of 18 km so we are going to get better battery with the DJI Mini 5, that means more flight time, that means more distance, so we will be able to fly more further. So it will be around, I would say, 20 or 23 kilometers. DJI Mini 4 has wind resistance of 10.7, so that will be also increased in the DJI Mini 5, I would say 11 or 12, so it will perform better in the wind situations. Is really nice. I don't think we will see so big design changes with the DJI Mini 5 because if you really look at the DJI Mini 4, I think it has really good you know, design features already. So I don't think we will see so big upgrades. Of course, there can be some minor changes, but I don't think there's going to be a huge design change on the DJI Mini 5. Again, they are trying to keep this drone under 250 grams, so I don't think we're gonna see so big differences on the design for sure. Obstacle avoidance system will be most probably better in the DJI Mini 5 Pro because that's one of the key features on the drones. Because of that, I think for sure we're gonna see some upgrades on the obstacle avoidance system on the DJI Mini 5 Pro. That will allow us to fly more comfortably, you know, we don't need to worry about some trees or you know, pipes or whatever you can think of when you're flying. Of course, it's always better to fly, you know, higher than those obstacles, then you will not have any problems. But if you are trying to capture some sort of video, which there is, you know, trees and pipes or whatever you can think of upgraded obstacle avoidance system will help a lot on those situations so i think there is going to be an upgrade on dji mini 5 so that's a really good thing to have i guess you can be sure that there's going to be a better camera on the dji mini 5 we can see higher frame rates and better image quality on the upcoming dji mini 5 it will perform better in the low light and the image will be better and crispier for sure what about the release date of the DJI Mini 5? Well, DJI Mini 4 has been released in September 2023. That's gonna be the same case. We're gonna see the upcoming DJI Mini 5 on the third quarter of the 2024 for sure. Because if you look at the DJI Mini series release dates in the past, DJI has always released mini series in the third quarter of the you know, current year. So I think that's gonna be the same case. 2024 third quarter I think is going to be the release date of the DJI Mini 5. But about the price of the DJI Mini 5? I think there's going to be a different budget options. Drone, drone with a simple controller and drone with a better controller. So drone will be like $750 I believe and then the simple controller will be like 800 or 900 price range and the better controller will go 1000 and over like 1200 let's say maximum at least that's my guess we have to just wait and see you might be wondering i'm giving some numbers and you know ideas about the upcoming drone and where am i getting these ideas well if you check the past dji always implemented 
the old drones specs to upcoming drones. What I mean by that is, for example, for the DJI mini series, they are taking the specs from the Mavic or Air series and then they are putting those specs to DJI mini series. For example, I have some information in front of me which I collected. DJI mini 4 has almost same specs with the DJI Mavic 2 Pro. So if you put the specs of these two drones, DJI Mini 4 and Mavic 2, you will see almost identical flight times, you know, hovering time and max flight distance with these two drones. What does this mean? So of course, they're gonna do, do almost the same. So in the DJI Mini 5, we will see some specs from the older drones. So that's why I am giving you this information and you can check my previous rumored specs video. Specs that I talked on that video was almost same with the final product when they released it. I just, you know, figured out by myself what kind of stuff we can see in the upcoming drone. I just wanted to share this with you. That's it for today. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you find it helpful, remember to crush the like button and don't forget to subscribe for the upcoming videos and I will see you guys in the next one.